Next door in Spain, the prime minister there is also urging Greece to take more ownership of its economic troubles as his country is preparing to loan Athens $10 billion as part of the overall rescue package. But the criticism isn't sitting well with Greeks who live in Spain. Dan Williams has this. There may be some sympathy in the Eurozone for Greece's situation, but not, it would appear, from Spain's Prime Minister, Mariano Rajoy. Spain has already loaned Greece 26 billion euros in previous bailout agreements. The new bailout deal would add another 10 billion to that total. But first, Rajoy will allow Spanish Parliament to debate the plan. Les anuncio even though this step is not obligatory in our country, it is my intent to take it to Parliament for debate and possible approval of the Spanish position on the program because there are a lot of funds that Spanish taxpayers are being asked to guarantee. Rajoy also called on Greece's politicians to act responsibly, saying too much time had been wasted. Well, Rajoy's comments could well touch a nerve with Spanish voters. The $26 billion debt that Greece already owes Spain is the equivalent, roughly, of what Spain pays out on unemployment benefits each year. And the message from Parliament is that they cannot afford to make those kind of loans without some kind of return. Spain's Greek community is calling for a more sympathetic approach. Pana Giotis Zara Lambidis runs a Greek restaurant in Madrid. He says his Spanish customers are more understanding about recent events. I see that my customers on a daily basis and they ask about it, how things are, what's going to happen, what do you think, how are family and friends. Everyone says the same thing, and we hope it changes because the people are hardworking. Alexis Papagiorgio operates a travel company specializing in holidays to Greece. He continues to reassure his customers that trips to Greece won't be hugely affected, but he fears for the long-term future of the country. Sadness. The feeling all Greeks have now is sadness, a lot of sadness, and a feeling of helplessness. Because you feel nothing good is going to come out of this situation. You know there are impossible goals we can't reach, political changes and useless elections that lead us to the same place. Spain's relations with Greece have been strained in recent weeks following the latest debt negotiations. A tough message from Spain's Congreso is only likely to heighten those tensions. Dan Williams, CCTV, Madrid.